it's one of these. Okay, so I gotta go deal with that douche first. And he can, like, teleport in effectively, so I need to, like, figure out where he is. And kill him very quickly. There he is. There's so much poison in this floor. Hear him. Don't like that. Fuck him up, fuck him up, fuck him up, fuck him up. Perfect. What is that? I can't tell. You know, I can't say I'm surprised that he had a treasure. But it is very disappointing that he had a treasure, because if I didn't come prepared for him, that would have been rough. Okay, for 100 Pocos, bringing our total to 24,400, the Universal Calm. Finally took down the little... Yeah! Nice. Congrats. I... Didn't lose anybody to falling rocks that I heard. Now grind them for max level. You've done that a few times. I mean, if she had the time, maybe. Hundred and thirty Pocos, bringing our total to twenty-four thousand five hundred forty-two. The stringent container, which is just a little tin of baking powder, and down we go. Sub level thirteen, the penultimate floor. Mercy. Mega Smash plus 
two power plant. Okay, hang on. Oh, You could stun him, maybe. Thank you. Okay. Grab some extra flowers. So in that little cubby, I think? That's a train. <laughs> yeah. well, the things working against you were the fact that you don't have a Mega Smash badge, and also Bombette is only super rank. Sometimes I forget you can rank up your party members. For 100 Pocos, bringing our total to 24,663. The Hypnotic Platter. Little A&W uh, bottle cap. Alright. How many Pikmin do we have? Ten. This is going to be a long boss fight. Alright. Down we go, to the final floor. Dream Den, sub-level 14. Final floor. First and foremost, I would like to point out that this is a GameCube. <laughs> With the position of the base being, um, where, uh, which button is it? The power button? No, the disc slot button. I don't remember. I just was looking at my GameCube, so you would think I would, but I'm me. I'm stupid. You know this. Alright. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave my yellows over there and separate the captains. Leave one of them by here. Grab the yellows with Olimar. Call everybody else to the president. Olimar's gonna take the yellows, and he's gonna fight this boss. <gasps> it's Louie! Is that Louie? Mr. President, I have located Louie, resting on a vast mound of treasure. For him to venture to these depths alone, the desire of man is a thing to be feared. Mm, but Louis is not moving. Could he have exhausted his strength in reaching these depths? There may be yet time. Quickly, to Louis's aid! Meet our final boss, a giant Fucking spider. Alright, first things first, we're going to push in, and I'm going to go after this part first. Because that is the most dangerous. To most Pikmin types. Normally we are immune to poison, but not here. Oh, crap. Okay, sure. Once more.
We don't have anything to fear here. We can keep attacking because these are yellow Pikmin and they are immune to electricity. I'm just gonna tank some of these hits because I can. We only have 10 Pikmin the Ow. We only have 10 Pikmin though, so it is going to take quite a while to deal damage. I'm going to actually run for this one. His body will go Ow. His body will glow the color of whatever uh, elemental attack he is going to use. He has everything. And he seems to be going for mostly electricity, so I'm not complaining. Because the sooner I get that done, the sooner I can grab the rest of the Pikmin. Because I could- ow. I can rescue the rest of the Pikmin from any other element and just deal with this one at a time. Electricity is done. That takes 30 strength, Jesus. Alright. Next up. We're going to leave the yellows behind. And the president is going to give us... Uh, we'll go with blues. And then he's gonna run back in like a scared little baby. And Olimar's gonna go grab the blues. To have an immunity! Which one is the... the water. He's doing fire right now, so we're gonna want to avoid that. Which means this one is the water. Hello? Thank you, guy. Once more, I can rescue the Pikmin from any of the other elements. I might want to hide out the yellows too. Maybe. I could hit the faucet here, that would be great, but I... Depth perception, man. I struggle with it a lot. Once I get some Pikmin on there, we're pretty good. Alright, he's firing, so we're gonna back off. Who did I lose? Why? Wait, what? How am I losing Pikmin over here? What? What just happened? Were they pushing each other out of bounds or something? I'm so confused. I thought it was the yellows and my own hubris that was killing Pikmin, but no. Turns out the game is still a glitchy mess, even in the final boss room. Get everything onto there. Grab everybody and back off. Oh, we wanna go this way. We're still losing guys. Why are we still losing guys? Hang on. Genuinely, I need to investigate this. What the fuck? Oh, I get it. I know what's happening. Hello, guy. Oh god, you can climb up there? Legitimately did not know that. So when he does the water shot, it looks like it's like flying over to President. I forgot that that could do that. Alright, cool. Good to know. Come to me. Legitimately, because I need you to back off. From the, uh, from where the yellows are. Yeah, yeah. Um, this game is a broken fucking mess. Hot garbage. But, you know, it's supposed to be the fair and balance or what have you. Ow. 
Ow. That wasn't fair, I was switching captains. Pikmin deaths at this point do not matter. As long as I have enough to carry the treasures at the end of this, I am happy. Yeah, now if only I could hit things. That would... That would be great. Without getting comboed so that I can rescue my Pikmin. Thank you. What the fuck just happened? Game! Legitimately would be helpful to get rid of, uh... To, to not... Just, just not. Okay, thank you, game. Alright, Olimar, get the yellows out of there. I need to regroup real quick. Uh, Alright, what's left? Fire and poison? I think I could do that with just the reds at this point. Alright. President, get in the corner. Back up. Deal damage. Come back to me. Does this even hit me? I don't think it does. It does. It does. Shit. Good to know. Why does he love the poison? I don't understand. You know what? Fine. I'll do the poison first. Fucking combos me. Get on the thing. Frankly, I think I would rather deal with the poison now. Cause yeah. Fuck this game. <laughs> Fair and balance my Fucking ass. It's about- this game is about as balanced as Smash 4 Bayonetta. I'll put it to you that way. Suffice to say, not at all. Please pop off. Please pop off. Please pop off. It didn't pop off. If I can get rid of the, um... The poison... 
If I'm honest, I will be good. But I kind of need to stop getting comboed by his fire attack. Depth perception. Okay, okay, thank you, game. Wait, why were guys fucking poisoned? You know, it would be absolutely phenomenal if I could land a goddamn hit. That would be fucking great, man. I need you to cooperate, please. Ow. Alright. Alright. Okay. We're on to the final weapon. The flamethrower. Ow. 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 Uh. Fair and balanced. Am I right? I am? I am. How much health does each thing have? I don't remember. Or if, or rather, I don't know. And if I did, I don't remember. But, like, I'm using Red Pikmin against a fire thing, so, like, I have infinity time on this. There we go. He dead. He ain't dead. Oh, he, he hit body. We finally have a health bar! He shed his skin because he was useless without his weapons. Oh, I'm out of red potions. Cool. Doesn't matter. I have red pigment. Without your armor, you will fall pretty easily, my friend. Enemy? Frenemy. We'll call you Frenemy. How about I call you Douchebag? How about that? Most of my suffering came from wanting to come fight you. Okay. He is absolutely going to be destroyed. All things considered, President, get out here. Bring the entire squad. We could take this fucker down easy.
And with this wave, this should be it. Down he goes. Uh, that was our final boss. Use the rest of the Pikmin to end it. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know when you sent that, but yeah. <laughs> Louie? Are you... Your life functions fading? No! He appears only to have fainted. He is always running into trouble. Instruct the Pikmin to carry him. There is not enough room for him in the cockpit anymore. We will have to keep him in the cargo hold with the treasure hoard. Yeah, we'll get to him in a minute. I guess I'll get some started on Louie. That actually takes significantly less time than I thought. God, Louis is too freaking light. I hate this. <sighs> For 1,000 Pocos, bringing our total to 25,670. The Shock Therapist. <coughs> Also for 1,000 Pocos, bringing our total to 26,670, the Monster Pump. Also for 1,000 Pocos, bringing our total to 27,670, the Comedy Bomb. Also for a thousand Pocos, bringing our total to 28,670, the Flare Cannon. <sighs> and the final thing on our list of things that we need to get. For 10 Pocos, bringing the total to 28,680, the King of Bugs. that, we can leave. That's all the treasures. Let's head to the surface. <laughs> we lost 56 Pikmin. God damn. But the cave is complete. Alright, save the game. Welcome back to the Wistful Wild. There's nothing left to do. So let's end the game. You've collected every treasure! And now we head home to Helkatate.
The Pikmin are quite the beautiful race, ain't they? And look at that. An orange onion. That's a Pikmin type we haven't seen before. And the red, blue, and yellow scatter again. Let's head home to our family. And sh ship Louie off to frickin' jail. Pikmin 2. I could see Australia from here. The end. What are you doing back there? Billy cat. A low game? Louis in the brig, yeah. <laughs> we spent 26 days. We. Excuse you, I was reading that. Well, I should be able to go back and, like, look at this myself. Five hundred ninety-five blue Pikmin. I sprouted almost six hundred. Jeez. Alright, let's go all the way back up, because I wanted to actually read that. We spent 26 days. We killed 786 Pikmin. 511 of them were lost to battle. One was left behind. 15 died to fire. 52 died to water. 96 to electricity. 100 to explosions. 11 to poison. We sprouted 1,334. 333 of them were red. 211 were yellow. 595 were blue. 55 were white. 140 were purple. Our total playtime was 20 hours and 4 minutes. <sighs> Where's my credits, game? Roll credits. <laughs> Is there no... Hmm. Interesting. Bonuses? There we go. We'll, we'll play this. <laughs> there we go. Uh, Alright. Louie is an asshole. <laughs> Let's pretend that this is a, a new credits for, for saving Louie. Gold, treasure completion, cinema, whatever. We do have one more thing to unlock. And honestly, I thought... I thought it unlocked automatically. Let me, let me check this. How do I unlock? You've collected the succulent series. Plunge into the juicy world of alien cuisine. You've collected the Paleontology series. Who knows what beasts these left these behind? You've collected the Ancient Secrets series. This old drunk will make romantics weep with joy. You've collected the Tortured Artist series. Everyone's inner artist will crave this set. You've collected the Space Love series. These designs transcend an intergalactic cultural barriers. By the way, the game is scrolling automatically. You've collected the Dream series. Consumers hear the word dream and open their wallets. 
You've collect- you got the blast from the past series. My nostalgic pitch will transform these oldies into hits. You've collected the massive receptacle series. Hokotations could practically live in these. You've collected the Ancient Ad series. These persuasive logos are amazing attention grabbers. You've collected the Odd Logo series. Indecipherable symbols are all the rage these days. You got the Titan Dweevil series. Entomologists and film directors will buy them by the whole load. Including Louie? Somehow I doubt that one. Do we have all of the... We should have all of the enemies. We don't have all of the enemies, wow. We don't have some of the candy pop buds. And that looks like it's it. <sighs> okay. Cool. Amazing. <sighs> what do you mean there's new treasures? Oh, because I haven't gone in and, like, investigated all of them? Do I have to read Olimar's journals? What am I doing here, game? Turn to title screen. It's not options. I don't know why I went to options. Bonuses? How do I unlock that last thing? Alright. We're gonna Google this because. It, uh, oh. Yeah, I don't feel like doing challenge mode. <sighs> yeah, I have to get a, 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 like, perfect score in all 30 challenges. Which, yeah, fuck that. I ain't doing that right now. Well, that was Pikmin 2. And, um, fuck Pikmin 2. I will be happy to never play this game again. Um, this game is not fair and balanced. This game is an absolute dumpster fire of a game. If you can avoid playing it, you probably should. If you want to play through all the Pikmin games, it is... I, I understand. And I apologize for your trauma. <laughs> I, it, it just sucks because I like... I love Pikmin 1 and 2... <laughs> And I like Pikmin, f or I, I love Pikmin 1 and 3, and I like Pikmin 4, but Pikmin 2 is just, it's just bad. It's just bad. <sighs> After the first game, they were like, a lot of people were like, damn, I wish I didn't have a time limit. And so Nintendo turned around and made it way too fucking difficult. Because they're like, oh, you want, you want infinite time? Cool. Here, have these dungeons that are randomly generated every time you uh, load a room. And then, uh, mm, mm. Patrick, I, I understand. I am sorry for your trauma. <laughs> the next game, I don't know when I'm gonna play it. Pikmin 3, but I can tell you for sure that it will be the deluxe version, and I will, I should be playing with Jordan. We'll be playing multiplayer. I guess I'll see you then, whatever that is.